I love the man's detail, passion, the way his mind works. It's always three steps ahead. He's the Steve McQueen of the automotive industry. He's Mr. Cool. You know, he's always been Mr. Cool. Well, Luca Montezemolo is the man who transformed in about 20 years Ferrari from a premium sports car manufacturer to a, an icon of worldwide luxury. He was by Enzo's side for years, and Enzo had total trust in his abilities. And obviously, Enzo was correct. Luca had the ability to do it and take it into the, you know, the, the new century. I could see that there was not a fear, but there was a, a huge amount of respect from the employees at the Ferrari factory, where you could see that he had come up working with Enzo and expected nothing but the best from his people. He demanded that from them, and he got it. Some things like racing demand attention to detail because, you know, one loose screw, whether it's in your head or in the car, is a real problem. It is a people business, so Luca was really able to take the best from all the team members. Anyone who runs probably a company, but certainly a team like Ferrari that's racing, I mean, you have to be, uh, have to be in touch with the people who are changing the tires, otherwise it doesn't work. Luca's uh, passion is made out of uh, emotion and Italian style, but uh, at the same time he is a very rational, uh, uh, clear and lucid vision. It's the evangelical quality of Luca that stands out. The commitment to what he wants and what he, he, he feels he's expected to do and to make that go out and spread in the world. It's called passion. He had a passion for the brand. He had passion for racing. He had gotten that passion from Enzo years before. You know, he had been taught by the best teacher ever. It speaks more of uh, Enzo Ferrari himself. I mean, they often say that a great man is known and his greatness is expressed by his successor. It's very hard to be great and have a great successor. And that's the, uh, and I think that Luca fulfills that promise. In an art museum, an automotive museum, there's a fantastic quote that Enzo had quoted saying, when you buy a Ferrari, you're buying an engine and you're getting a car around it. And Luca continued that brand. And that is their, that's really what makes a Ferrari a Ferrari. Racing and Ferrari are kind of quintessentially Italian and uh, what the, it, it's all about in Italy. I'm sure when he took the position, he was totally confident that he could turn the company around and make it hugely successful as he did. If you look at when he, start, when he, when he took over on, on his watch compared to where it is today, you know, I think that's a, his major accomplishment in life. Bringing Ferrari back to race at the highest level. Uh, that sort of, in, you know, lifted everybody's spirits. It contributed, I think, to, uh, you know, intellectually, educationally, and industrially to the spirit uh, of the nation.